DIY Guy with MyDIYGuy.com and today I'm going to teach you how to take a door off. Uh, first thing you're going to need, you're going to need a hammer and you're going to need a screwdriver like a small flat head or a small Phillips head screwdriver will work as well. Uh, the first thing you need to know is that it's not necessary for you to actually take the hinges off completely to remove the door. Uh, you can simply pop the pins on the hinge and pull it out which that's what I'm going to show you how to do here. Uh, first thing you need to do is you want to line the screwdriver up at the bottom of the hinge pin Put it on there and go ahead and hammer it. Knock that pin loose until it comes out the top like this. Go ahead and pull it on out. It's a lot easier to go ahead and leave the door shut when you're pulling the pins. That way the door stays in there and you're not having to support it and it's not putting pressure on the other hinges that have not been pulled loose yet. So you want to do that for each, each hinge. Go ahead and pull that pin out. So once you get all the pins out, you want to take the door, you want to make sure you have all your hinge pins loose and out. Go ahead and take the door by the doorknob, maybe support the bottom of, of the hinge on the door with your hand here. Go ahead and pull it out, pull it completely out and that's how you remove the door. Now if the hinges are too, uh, too tight and you can't get them to come loose with the screwdriver and the hammer. You can always lubricate them with something like WD-40 or something similar to that. Let it sit for a little bit so it kind of works its way in there and then try again. Uh, that should release it if it's rusted shut or anything like that. Um, I'm the DIY Guy with MyDIYGuy.com and that's how you remove a door.